What's up, YouTube? Back with another video. Back with another video. Back with another video. Back with another video. Today. All right, go ahead. We're doing a mukbang slash rules slash expectations we have with our baby. Rules we expect everybody to respect. <sighs> I'm out of breath, okay. Yes, you gotta respect it or you, we just gonna be distant. So we got McDonald's, got a Big Mac. No, what? Yeah, no onions, extra pickles, extra mac sauce. Ready, bit it. I'm ready, almost done with my fries. And I got two bacon McDoubles, no onions. One got Big Mac sauce and one got uh, mayo. And I got a Sprite. All right, so without further ado, let's get into the rules. Rule number one, no kissing the baby. Please don't kiss my child on the face, the hands. Just don't kiss her at all. I don't, you know babies break out easily and yeah. it's been stuff like seeing on TikTok babies getting herpes from people having cold sores. And it's just too much. Just to prevent anything, just don't kiss the kid. Rule number two. Please don't post anything until we post something. Any pictures, like we'll send you pictures. Well, I'm saying you like we talk to somebody. But if we send you pictures and stuff, please don't post until we post. You didn't get no letters on that? I forgot. Rule number three. Wash your dirty ass hands. It only take a couple seconds. God damn, y'all niggas be nasty as hell. Wash them fucking hands, please. We'll be there to remind you anyway. Yeah. Rule number four. When you carry the baby, do not lean the baby on your dirty outside clothes. We will provide everyone with shirts. No, I'm just no, we won't. <laughs> we'll provide you with a baby blanket so you can leave the baby on the blanket. Then we're gonna wash the blanket because it was on your dirty clothes. Give me a second. Five. Rule number five. Baby can't go anywhere without us. Not until the baby could let us, well. That's gonna be a long time. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Until we feel comfortable. Cause yeah. it's our first kid and I don't know. I'm gonna just be a little paranoid. Yeah, me too. Not that we don't trust anybody. It's just that we don't. I don't know. That's just a valid rule. It's a baby. Anything could happen. Next. I'd rather be there. Six. Oh, number six. No sleepovers. I think this goes until like until they're older too. You could have people over, but I don't know about you sleeping over anybody else's place. I was never allowed to sleep over people's house. And I'm alive. Rule number seven. Mm. Call before you pop up. Please. Just no call, no show. Like, if you don't call and you pop up. You're just going to have to leave because. He's just going to be outside. Nobody open. No, I'm just. <laughs> Especially with the newborn. I'm going to try to sleep when the baby sleep. If you pop up and we sleep, I'm not getting up. Oh, that's another rule I could have. So that makes it what number? That motherfucker was good. Number what? That was number seven, so number eight. Rule number eight. Do not wake the baby up. Like, if you come visit, you let them know you're going to come visit. Baby sleeping. Please don't wake the baby up. I don't think that's good for I don't babies. want no, uh, 
I'm gonna just go in there and see her. I ain't gonna wake her up. Yeah. Then somehow magically the baby fucking woke. Yeah, we gonna have a camera in that motherfucker. I mean, yeah, because we I'm got a baby you. monitor. And rule number, what was that? Eight, eight, nine? This will be nine. Rule number nine. This, this is, really is not, hospital, yeah, this is not for nobody. This is just for the people at that motherfucking hospital who be trying to do some weird sneaky shit. Like, my kid is not getting mixed up with nobody else's kid and switched out and all this dumb ass shit that I be seeing on the internet that really don't happen a lot, but it's not gonna happen to us. My kid is standing in that motherfucking but room. But it happened the other day. Down here? Yeah. That lady that stole <clears throat> the baby was here. Oh, shit. Well, anyways, for you motherfuckers at the hospital who gonna be taking care of us and make sure everything go good, y'all gonna be doing that in that room. Mm -hmm. The baby is not to leave the room and go in no motherfucking sleeping with all the other babies or none of that. Nah. This baby stand right here where one of us can see. They be trying to get you because they be like, so you could get some rest. Yeah, fuck that. You ain't gonna be injecting my kid with all this weird ass shit. We watching yeah. you motherfuckers too. But other than that, I mean, it's, it's really no strict rules and no rules that I would see people getting upset about. Because, no, it's just like common sense. Just like precautions. Because that shit that I never did to other people's kids. Yeah. Like, I ain't never Don't touched kiss the baby's face, kiss, kiss the baby. Like, that's just And weird. please be careful with the baby head because, you know, they got a soft spot. Like, just be careful. That's just shit that I ain't never do to nobody's kids. So I expect the same back, you know, so... Yeah, just respect the rules or get disciplined, nigga. No, I'm just fine. It's just, I mean, if you don't follow the rules, that's just weird because they're not nothing like out of this world. That's like, oh my God, they so. Yeah, perfect. but if it's you really. do decide that you don't want to follow the rules, then you just won't get to see the baby. Yeah, because that's like. That's, like you said that's weird but anyways guys thanks for watching this video like comment subscribe also follow us on all social media platforms which will be in the description down below we do have another video coming should we post this today kind of late or tomorrow they got school tomorrow well we have another video coming after this is going to be uh prenatal yoga, yoga. So we're going to try to do something. That should be a little interesting and funny. Hopefully you don't be pooping in certain positions. But no, I'm just playing. Um, also, should we open up a P.O. box? Y'all don't have to send us stuff, but if you do, it could like be anything. Like letters, anything. Yeah, you can send us a, a letter. We're going to read it on camera. A shirt that y'all make, uh, underwear, uh, anything that y'all make. Y'all can send us a book. Like, I got two books that I want. I'll put them up. I'll put them up in the, um, at the end of this video. So, like, any that? advice y'all have as um, parents and you want to share, drop it down below in the comments or anything. So, let us know if y'all want us to open up a P.O. box and we'll get that done ASAP. Thanks for watching. Until next time.